Hey, what's up, guys? It's Jack. I'm back for another Jack walk. I'm actually doing this walk inside of my house because I've already shot this video twice, and both times it didn't work. Something something uh, happened. Uh, there was a technical problem. But what I want to talk about today is something that I think is important, and um, so. My students, I teach at a, a university in South Korea, and my students will come up to me from time to time and they will say, Jack, how can I upgrade my English? They often use the expression upgrade my English. And what they mean is how can I improve my English ability? And there's a million, you know, a million ways you can improve your, your English ability. I mean, you could live in America for 10 years. That would improve your English. Um, you could pay a lot of money for expensive lessons and study three hours a day. Um, that would help improve your English for sure. Um, but those are not possibilities for a lot of people. For most of us, we have jobs, we have families, we have you know, we're busy and we don't have unlimited resources like, um, you know, millions of dollars that we can spend on, on English lessons. So what do you do in that case? What do I tell my students who say, I want to upgrade my English, but what they, what they're really looking for is I think a strategy. And so what I tell them is that I've, I have my own strategy and I'm going to share that secret with all of you in this video. And it's, I call it the 10 to 365. Okay. The 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 2, 1, 2, 365, 365. And you're probably wondering, what does 10, to 365 mean. And I'm going to give you an outline of exactly what it is. And then I'm going to give you a challenge. I want you to do the 10 to 365 challenge. So 10 is stands for 10 minutes. Okay. 10 minutes. What I want you to do is for 10 minutes a day, I want you to either read or listen to some English, okay? Now, English material can't be anything, okay? So it can't be too easy. If it's not challenging for you, it's not going to help you. You're not going to grow. In order to grow, it has to be challenging. However, on the opposite side, it can't be too difficult. If it's too difficult, you also are not going to learn anything and you're not going to grow. So it needs to be a little bit beyond your current ability. So if you are a seven, you need to find something that is in the seven and a half or eight range. If you are a two, you should find material that is at a three. If you, do you understand what I'm saying? It needs to be a little bit more difficult than what your current ability is. But if you are at a two and you are uh, watching something or listening to something or reading something that is a seven, you will never improve. That will not help you. That's not useful. So a little bit beyond your a current ability is what you're is what you want and 10 minutes a day of either listening or reading english material listening or reading english material 10 minutes a day 10 minutes that's the 10 okay what's the 2 i want you to memorize i want you to learn two new vocabulary words every day Two new vocabulary words every day. That's it. No matter what. Two words you didn't know yesterday 
but now you know them today because you, you know the meaning. You can use it in a sentence, just two words a day. Let's do the math. 10 minutes of listening or reading every day in a week is 70 minutes. In a year, that's approximately 60 hours of English reading and listening. 60 hours. That's, that's fantastic. That's wonderful. Think about that. 60 hours. That's three days straight, no sleeping, of just reading and listening to English. Two words a day. 365 words times two, that's in a year, you have learned 730 new words. 730 new words, 60 hours of listening and reading. Think about that. That's the 10, 2, and then, of course, you know what the 365 means. Every day. No holidays. It's your birthday. 10 minutes, two words. It's Christmas, 10 minutes, two words. It's another religious holiday in your country, whatever holiday it is, 10 minutes, two words. Every single day. Three, 10, two, 365. 10, two, 365. I challenge you to do 10 minutes of reading and listening every day. I challenge you to learn two new vocabulary words every day, and I challenge you to do it every day. 10 to 365. 10 to 365. If you're asking yourself, Jack, where do I get the material? How can I find it? We have 10 minute episodes of the A to Z English podcast. Go to A to Z English podcast.com and listen to an episode. There you go. That's your 10 minutes. Go to English Word Master. There are hundreds of vocabulary words on that website. Memorize two of them every day. Two words that you don't know, English Word Master. Go to free online English lessons. Listen to one of my Jack Walks. If it's the right level for you, Use it. If it's too difficult, find something easier on YouTube. If it's not difficult enough, find something more difficult. But go out there, give it 10 minutes a day, two new words a day, 365 days a year. And after a year, you will have upgraded your English, as my students like to say, 100% you will improve, okay? And obviously, you can do more than 10 minutes a day if you want to, and many of you already do. But what I'm saying is consistency is the key. You know, if you study three hours one day and then you don't study for another four weeks, what's the point? 10 minutes a day, two words a day, every single day, 365 days a year. All right, everybody, that's the end of my, uh, of my Jack Walk. This was an inside Jack Walk of Jack's house. I'm just going back and forth between the bedrooms and the living room and the kitchen in my apartment here in South Korea. Um, but it'll work. And uh, go to the YouTube channel, free online English lessons to watch my videos like the video, subscribe to the video, hit the notifications button. And uh, I apologize for any technical uh, difficulties that I experienced today. Um, and uh, I will do better in the future. But I'm trying to make a video every single day. I'm trying to follow the 10 to 365, except I'm applying it to YouTube instead. 10 minute video, um, two new ideas every day and uh, 365 days a year. So I'll do it, you do it, we'll do it together. All right, thanks everybody. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.